Hello everyone, this is the tutorial to build a photozooka, a not so creative union between potato and bazooka. Obviously, it's a real weapon. Use gas and potato bullets is dangerous, so please be careful. Okay, so let's see what you need. Well, what do we need? A small pipe we will use to do the barrel of our gun. I choose a 50 millimeters diameter. A stopper, a big pipe we will use to do the combustion chamber of our gun, a special glue that stick on PVC and all the reduction from the big diameter to the small diameter. What's more, I have a cutting stuff, a drilling stuff, a lighter, that is flexible, lighter, you see? Gas, button gas, another kind of glue, and two uh, 87 degree turns. Drill your stopper to do a little hole, a little hole here, passing hole. The diameter should be right to do this, push the gas out. Use the two turn with the stopper facing down and drill them here. This hole we will use to insert this hole here we will use to insert the lighter in the pipe. And this is the result. As you can see, I cut the combustion chamber to a proper dimension. I make this turn here to make it more ergonomic to put it on my shoulder. This is the trigger. I use silicone to put it here and it goes more or less half of the diameter in. Don't save the glue the connection should be strongly fixed with no holes. If necessary, use some screws to fix it to the other connection. Here you can see a long screw. It works as the bottom of your barrel. The potato position is here. This passage here is quite important. So I suggest to you to use more pieces as you can in order to make it smoothly go from that diameter to this diameter. This configuration here is better than this configuration. This configuration here causes strong stress on your weapon and also you lose a lot of uh, pressure energy from the gas so your bullet will go slower. The potato should fit perfectly in the barrel so I suggest to shape it in to make it like a cylinder in the barrel. You see? And this is the cylinder in the barrel. Then you push it down to the bottom. Push it down the bottom of your barrel. Charge your weapon and shut. 
remember that you need enough hair inside the chamber to burn the gas. So now, for example, if I charge again the gun, it will it won't work. In this case, you should open the combustion chamber and let go some air in. Maybe blow in it. Then be careful and open the trigger, use the trigger to <clears throat> make it burn. Be careful because a flame like this come out. So to make it work again, you have to open your combustion chamber and let go in some air. If there is wind, there's no problem. You can use the wind force to make go in some air. If not, I suggest to you to blow in. Sometimes. Then close it again. Oh, you can use it again. Thank you for watching and don't forget to put like on this video.